So just don't fill me in. Hi everyone. I just thought I would make a bit of a quick video. I've been stuck inside for quite a few days due to the coronavirus, probably like you, but I thought it'd be good to talk about the coronavirus from the point of view of a person with disability who is apparently quite um, vulnerable and high risk. I'm 30 years old. My name is Carl. I've got a disability. I use a wheelchair. I don't actually have the coronavirus or any symptoms, but I'm one of those people who is unfortunately at a higher risk than other people. I'm living in Melbourne. It's a really nice sunny day today. Obviously we can't go out and do too much, but, but I'm not totally alone though. I'm living with my girlfriend Kirsty, and we're both working from home, which is good. Um, lucky the internet works because otherwise we'd be a bit stuffed. I think it's a bit dangerous for everybody to be talking about the coronavirus and thinking that only, you know, the old people are going to be affected by it because, you know, I don't think I'm quite old yet, but I'm really worried that, you know, if I do contract the virus that I would be affected by it because of my disability and, you know, some resulting complications of that. So it's not just a problem, you know, about, you know, make, make, making sure that older people are, are well, but it's about people with disability as well. So. It's about doing the right thing and trying to reduce the spread of the virus so we can all go back to living our lives. We're all encouraged um, to social distance, which means you know avoiding people. And I can't do that when there's about 15 uh, members of staff, you know, personal care assistants who help me, you know, throughout the weeks. And that's you know that's a good thing because I you know need need assistance, but also it can be a bit worrying because you know, I'm not wanting anyone to be to be sick uh, because that might get me sick. And as I said before, I'm in one of those vulnerable groups. Uh, and lots of people with disability, I think at the moment, are a bit worried about how it's all going to go down. You know, there's that risk of people being in ICU, you know, taking out beds. And there's the risk that if people with disability, you know, do get sick, who's going to be prioritised in intensive care. And that's something which we don't really know how it's going to unfold yet. So it's concerning. One thing I am trying to do is, uh, you know, go for walks and things during the day. Obviously I can't actually walk. Um, so I'm gonna go for a bit of a roll down the street. I'm a bit of a, a, bit of a hoarder, I feel like. Um, I've got enough toilet paper to last quite a while and that was before everyone started buying it. If there's anything else that you want me to talk about, let me know. Probably no one will comment because it's my first video, but I'll probably make some more anyway because nothing else to do right now. So anyway, thanks. Bye.